Researchers have now detected the Omicron variant in every wastewater facility in the Show Me State. And while the data is alarming researchers, they say there is a silver lining. New tonight, our Holden Kerwicki shows us how this could be a, the beginning to the end of this pandemic. At the University of Missouri, researchers are keeping watch over our waste. There's a lot you can learn from a little bit of sewage. Unfortunately, Professor Mark Johnson says the data they're collecting on COVID across Missouri stinks. A lot of places are seeing all-time highs since the beginning. At MSD Lime, which services downtown, he watched as the viral load went up nearly 800% in just two weeks. It, it says to me that there's a lot more people infected. That's why the numbers from the Coldwater Creek wastewater plant in North County hitting record highs are causing so much concern. I, I think things are going to get worse in Missouri before they get better. Johnson says his research shows Delta and Omicron have become the dominant strains in the Show Me State, but that's not all they're detecting. We have come across uh, lineages before that we don't know where they're coming from. Whether, whether we're going to spot the next um, pie, I think, is what comes next. I, I don't know. If it, if it starts in Missouri, then we'll probably see it first. Is there a silver lining in some of these numbers, even though it looks <clears throat> like that load is just going up and up and up? I, well, the silver lining, I guess, is that the, the pandemic is going to effectively be over when people stop getting ho hospitalized. That's going to happen when everyone's been vaccinated. But the reality is they can be vaccinated the modern way or the old fashioned way. I don't think many people are going to get through this wave without any immunity. As for what that means for their predictive models moving forward. There's a good chance that this is the last major wave that is going to cause hospitalizations and deaths. In St. Louis, Holden Kerwicki, five on your side. If you would like to take a look at what's in the wastewater in your area, Mizzou posts their results once per week, and you can find the link in the As Seen on TV section at KSTK.com.